Micha chapter 6. Hear now what Yahweh is saying. Arise, strive with the mountains, and let the hills hear your voice. Hear, O you mountains, the controversy of Yahweh, and you everlasting foundations of the earth. For Yahweh has a controversy with his people, and he shall reprove Israel. My people, what have I done to you, and how have I wearied you? Answer me, for I brought you up from the land of Mitzrayim, and I ransomed you from the house of bondage, and I sent Moshe, Aharon, and Miriam before you. My people, remember, please, what Balak, sovereign of Moab, counseled, and what Bilam, son of Beor, answered him, from Shittim to Gilgal, in order to know the righteousness of Yahweh. With what shall I come before Yahweh, bow myself before the high Elohim? Shall I come before him with ascending offerings, with calves a year old? Is Yahweh pleased with thousands of rams or ten thousand rivers of oil? Shall I give my firstborn for my transgression, the fruit of my body for the sin of my being? He has declared to you, O man, what is good, and what does Yahweh require of you but to do right, and to love, loving commitment, and to walk humbly with your Elohim. The voice of Yahweh cries to the city, And let sound wisdom see your name. Hear the rod and him who appointed it. Are there still treasures of wrongness in the house of the wrong, and the short measure that is an abomination? Would I be innocent with wrong scales, and with a bag of false weights? For her rich men are filled with cruel unrighteousness, and her inhabitants have spoken falsehood, and their tongue is deceit in their mouth. So I also, I shall strike you with a grievous wound, to lay you waste because of your sins. You shall eat but not be satisfied, and your inside be empty and you shall store up but not save, and what you save I shall give to the sword. You shall sow but not reap, you shall tread the olives but not anoint yourselves with oil, and make sweet wine but not drink wine. For the laws of Omri are strictly observed, and all the works of the house of Ahav, and you walk in their counsels. Therefore I give you for a ruin, and your inhabitants for a hissing, and let you bear the reproach of my people.